Hello everyone, we are back with Glen Velvet Reviews. Um, I just got my new, uh, I just got this angle piece, 90 degree angle hose elbow that I got. I'm planning to use this for my reef tank is the, pro is the plan because uh, I won't be, I'll show you my setup, but I'm gonna have to put it like this, or you're gonna see my setup to understand what I have to do with this. So let's cut this open, see what it looks like. I mean, it's a piece of brass. It should be fine and do its purpose. Let's check. Okay, so it's a nice piece of heavy brass. That's why I got it. Um, it was a few dollars, but I mean, it's worth it. So this is what I got. I'm going to show you my setup to see where I'm going to put this because I got it. I'm going to use this for my water changes on my uh, fish tank, on my reef tank. I plan to run, uh, if you saw my other videos, um, I plan to run my hose over here. And it's gonna come out over there, over here. There it is, right there, under the bed. I, uh, my girlfriend tucked it away because she didn't want anyone to trip on it. So there it is, right there. So that's gonna come out, and it's gonna go right into here. Now the problem is, is that, you know, I don't want the hose to be kinking or anything like that. So I'm gonna put this in here, like this. And then I'm gonna hook the hose up right to it, and this way the hose won't be so kinked. Because uh, putting the hose right like this is going to have a kink on it. It's not going to be good. This way it won't have a kink in it if I put it just like this. So that's my plan. So like I said, this can give you an idea. Maybe it'll work for you. Maybe it won't. Um, I plan to get one of those, um, you know, those hoses, expandable hoses. Because... Um, those are not recommended for long-term use. Those are recommended for short-term use. So you can get one of those. I'm going to try to get one of those and put that through and run it from right underneath this door or, you know, whatever I got to do, run it right under here if I have to. Uh, we'll see what I can do. And we're going to run the water line over there. And um, that's it. And then we're going to hook it up just like this. And we're going to run the water. And it's going to be hooked up just like that. And this way... Like I said, um, the hose won't be so kinked, and I'll be able to turn the water on and, um, you know, get the water out of my reef tank as quick as possible in the easiest way without having problems with kinked hoses and stuff like that. All right, so, uh, all right, so that's about it. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye-bye.